since losing my brain, I started spending a lot of time watching the very last drop of something. When's the last time you just like had the gift to watch the very last drop of something, to go so deep in the moment that being bored was not a notion of conception, never entered the frame to begin with. And so I've been doing that, and it's been so much fun. And look how thick I made this shake. It's a whole feast protein shake, and you'll see last a lot less drops of this one. When you start to pay attention to those last drops, some of the most beautiful gifts are you realize if you shift your head forward or to back too far, even to the left or to the right, how it changes the shape and the experience. It's the higher resolution, it's the perspective, it's staying there for that last drop. One more drop of blood, one more new orientation in time and space to taste something different, to do something different. And when I say different, I mean more beautifully, better, more. Because when you actually spend the time tasting something beautiful on the right side, even though it, uh, there's, there's not a different taste per se, there's such a wildly different experience because the second that thing is gone, the other side of the face craves. It's like there's a tingling sensation on the opposite side. <laughs> And so that doesn't happen when you taste something from the front or to the back, especially in extreme measures. That doesn't happen. That's just a wildly different, truer expression of what it is. But man, when you stay there for those last drops, all roads bleed through and through. That's a delicious as fuck whole feast protein shake. I just had this awesome salad. I actually eat the whole thing, beauty berries from down there, a bunch of nuts, some... Fertilized egg yolks were in there. The whole feast protein shake, I think you saw some of that earlier. It's thick, delicious. I can't stop eating it. It just tastes like very good. It has a banana in there too. And the Joe Cohen uh, High Priest Formula. The salad also had mixed nuts, sprouts, <laughs> yeah. Oh, so a drizzle of olive oil, so good, bro. Uh, splash of maple, oh, some of the honey. I call it honey compost. It's the honey, the hive, the honeycomb, the bee bits, nectar larvae, and all of it kind of uh, in the propolis all together. And um, had some of that in the salad. <laughs> and a splash of 82 sea salt out here just like this this is the white space that I get a exist in now between the moments where I've slowed down so much where I've actually surrendered to just the truth Liver King 3.0 that's the holy trinity of what I express now I tell the truth now Nothing but the truth. That's what I do. No thinking required. None at all. And I came out here just to have breakfast. And the salad is like something that just kind of organizes on its own. A bit goes in here, a bit goes in there. But there's like a extra element of that thing has been cared for, nurtured, satiated in a way. A level of sacrifice and reciprocity. And value that one might see and admire in oneself to express a higher form, a barbarian methodology. All roads bleed through barbarian. So, have I lost it? Midlife crisis. God, I hope so. Oh, I hope so. If I can continue to lose myself, the dissolution of the ego that's been so beautifully gifted and lifted. <laughs> You know, if I can lose myself more, the more I tend to lose myself, the more the soul just shows up and 
wants to be radically vulnerable, to just express the truth effortlessly, that's when, like, the pure genius, the white space, the very last drop, the beauty that there is there, that gave me all of this moment. Midlife crisis. Have I lost it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I've lost it. The life that I get to live right fucking now, right fucking now, that is... My queen is my family, is my boys, is my running around here with the dogs. <laughs> this crown is bolted to the heart, not the head. We've talked. It's the soul. It be the soul. That's the self-healing wisdom of the soul. That's pretty strong. It's pretty fucking take a joke, make a joke. That's what's lurking time for breakfast. Did I lose it? God, I hope so. I hope I continue to lose it. Because I know for certain that it's limitless, multi-directionally, geometrically, quantumly, it's limitless to be lost so much so in any and every fucking moment, every category of life, physically, socially, emotionally, relationally, metaphysically, spiritually, to lose oneself so much so to surrender to the beauty that it is, to feel so safe. The intimacy that one gains and gets and gets to multiply everything that's good and true. I hope that I pray to God. I catastrophically continue to lose it. Because it's losing it never felt so good. Losing it never felt more like the truth. Losing it felt, never felt like uh, <laughs> I didn't have to try to do something to be a thing. And now I can be the man that I fucking love and admire and everything that I get to see and experience is beautiful. And when there's pain or resistance, I run so fucking far deep and through into it and know with such discernment how to solve that problem. And it's the compressed pain across all of those categories that are infinite that gives us the infinite rise is the reward is the pleasure all roads bleed through a true barbarian that's life i get to live now is a much more beautiful pure true state i get a lever king 3.0 the holy trinity that's what i do again no thinking required don't ever forget this is very effortless no hesitation zero reservation no boundaries limitless every direction compressed pain all roads bleed through barbarian i hope that i continue to catastrophically lose it geometrically <laughs> Uh, orders of magnitude economically and just whatever new depth to describe the metaphor for the hyperbolic hyperbole <laughs> with no gravity a fucking tad of levity to light it the fuck up with lightning bolts to have a little bit of fun to lose it at the depth at which there can be the rise in the I fucking love what I get to do and feel and express and to be with such freedom. Yeah, yeah, boy. Full send all that fucking love and light. Losing it. Liver King 46, 47. Take a joke, make a joke. <laughs> Pick a fight, make a fight. Just do something. Fire, fire, aim. Grow, go. Leap light year, entering new orbits, new atmospheres. Lever King 3.0, the holy trinity of the truth, completely lost it. I pray to God. Yeah, boy. <laughs> All roads bleed through barbarian. You already know.